you follow hands up, you're a sheep. Before I get started, I just want to mention two things. First off, notice your reactions to this video. Notice how this triggers you. Notice why and how you clicked on this video. Second thing is, Hanzo has a lot of great content. He's spreading a really good positive message. You know, men's mental health, taking care of your body, building social skills, these sorts of things are very important. And I believe that they are a part of a great life. But the thing that I have wrong with Hamza is this cult and this dogma and that it has these people that just blindly follow and just kind of attach to this ideal of what Hans is putting forth, this kind of Adonis or Jeffrey. And I'd recommend you kind of look into Spiral Dynamics and you'll see that this is a blue, very blue kind of tactic. And some of Hans's topic is like a healthy orange and some of it's even green in that the community that it kind of creates and, you know, kind of like trying to build together this tribe. But most of it's kind of blue or orange. So look at Spiral Dynamics if you kind of want to understand where that is a bit more. And the thing with the cult is that it's for broken, sensitive, isolated people that feel like outsiders that don't really have a place and they get attached to this charismatic leader. And in this case, it's Hamza. And they're attached to him, what the message that he's spreading. And a lot of it is positive, but I see so many people that are just really negative and angst-filled and insecure and they're just attaching to Hamza because he seems so charismatic, he seems like he has it all together. And that's really um, inspiring for lots of young men. And I felt inspired by this as well. You know, and like I said, a lot of things that he says are very healthy and are very beneficial for people. But at the end of the day, the prescribed life is no way to live. If you're living for someone else, if you're living based on someone else's concepts of a good life, you're not really living because you're not living your life. You're not developing your gifts, your strengths and your skills. And you're not working on the things that you want to and developing your own vision and what your ideal life would be. And this is so much more powerful because when you build your own life, then it's like, oh, this is mine. This has a sense of resonance in me. It's not prescribed by someone else. You know, I'm not insecure and unconfident and attaching to someone else. I'm building my own kind of ideas. So I would recommend that you go into Dan Co, Actualize.org and David Data to kind of go into this kind of spiritual side and find your purpose and develop your vision for life. So what about me? You know, am I just using Hamza to get more clout, to bring all of his followers onto me, you know, because I believe that I have a better message to share? Maybe, but why would I trigger so many of his followers, you know, his loyal following? Why would I create this video that's going against the grain of kind of some of the things that he's teaching, you know, following this strict protocol and these kind of things? And develop, and develop your, and I'm advocating for developing your own rather than um, following along someone else's. Am I just trying to get his followers to follow me? No, I'm not creating this video for these people. I don't really care about that. What, what I want is I feel like this message needs to be shared for other people like me that were insecure and unconfident in themselves and they would attach to whatever charismatic leader or whatever kind of person or ideal or protocol to try and fix their life. And none of these things are really gonna fix their life. They may help you, they may have some good components to them, but it's up to you to take out which components you like and which components align with you and develop your own vision. So I'm creating this video for these people because I want them to develop and think bigger. You know, I want them to create their own vision for their life because I've been stuck in this and I wanna help these other people that are like me that don't feel fulfilled and feel kind of lost and they're just trying to fix it, fill in that hole with, you know, for example, with Hamza, with following his protocols and his kind of ideas and, you know, just following it like dogma. And I'm creating this video for these people because I want them to be a part of this channel. I want them to be a part of my community. So thank you for watching if you did and I'll see you in the next video.